Libra. Hi, it's Lisa here from What's the Name Tarot. I'm here to do your weekly reading for the week of Monday the 3rd to the 9th of April 2023. These are general readings only, so just take with you what resonates. Check your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, any number synchronicities that may occur, and cross watches are welcome. Also, I have uploaded the monthly readings for April for each sign. If you go to my um, channel page and go to the playlist tab, um, each sign has their own folder of readings there. Okay, so let's begin. I love this. You are number one, Libra, Ant Spirit, time to collaborate. This is all about working together as a team to get the best possible results and very hard working. See those ants um, working non-stop there and that is a, all a collaboration that brings their final achievements, their final results together. Love that. Libra. Let's begin. 3rd to the 9th of April 2023. Clear messages from Spirit, please, for Libra. Overall, you get the chariot. Love that. May have connection to a Cancer here. Time to get things moving forward and happening. Balancing that chariot out, keeping it at a steady pace, not getting the speed wobbles I usually say by forcing it to go faster than it has to. Time to collaborate, time to get things moving. Love it. Goes together. Past energies, you had the King of Swords, the Deceiver, the Star. May have had connection to an Aquarius or can, um, Capricorn back here in the past, but I feel like this negative toxic energy that was trying to prevent you from moving forward, um, it was all... I don't want to say all for nothing. It's been one tough life lesson, but I feel like taking action, that King of Swords is almost like cutting that off right there. Enough is enough. Using your head over your heart. Very logical. You know your dreams, your wishes, your hopes, what you want to be doing here. And that deceiver energy is not part of the equation. And um, it may have taken a bit of a collaboration here. It may have taken this chariot to get things railroading over top of that deceiver energy. But it was something that was happening back there in the past that was preventing you from moving forward. We'll clarify everything shortly. But present energies, the full Queen of Swords, Two of Pentacles. King and Queen of Swords already, power couple here when it comes to taking action and you're ready to take a whole different approach towards something or someone and I feel like you're ready to just jump in two feet and all and see where it takes you, see where that whole ripple effect goes. Um, that's taken a bit to get the balance and alignment back into place, even within, even out here. It is a constant juggle still and I feel like just being aware that that leap of faith, as I said, that ripple effect, it may cause a bit of a juggle to be happening around this two of pentacles again but but there's always a but in saying that this is a whole new approach that you are taking this is a leap of faith that you possibly haven't taken before even thought about taking before and you're just ready to do it wow libra Future energies, Princess of Pentacles, Five of Wands, Queen of Wands. I feel like this Five of Wands is coming back to this deceiver energy. There's some drama, some conflict, some disagreements. You've taken a chance and gone in a whole different direction than somebody else wanted you to. And I feel like it's a bit of a backlash of that. Um, but so be it. This is your journey. This is um, the chariot is for you here. This is your journey. This is your leap of faith. This is what you're doing. There is this partnership collaboration right here on the table. Literally. <laughs> Princess of Pentacles, putting an offer forward, confident the two of you do make a good team. Collaboration is here from Spirit Animal Oracle. And this is that collaboration that's happening. It may be an offer around love, around work, around home. 
but there may be a bit of drama that's involved around this offer that's being made maybe a bit of jealousy you may be getting a job promotion that somebody else may have been expecting or even getting a job that someone else may have been expecting but um, I'm just going to say that is their drama to deal with and you know what you want who you want where you want to be and this is that confidence and determination now to go after your dreams and your goals this chariot is getting on the move so love that really um not bad for an underlying reading we will clarify everything here starting with the chariot overall for libra Knight of Swords, Nine of Cups, Seven of Cups. Not rushing into things. We talked about not getting the speed wobbles with the chariot. This is about just going with the flow, keeping things at a moderate pace here, thinking things through carefully because you have options in front of you. Sometimes they are overwhelming to look at every single one that there is, but sometimes you need to dig deep to see what some of them do actually hold. Um, this emotional happiness, it is there for the taking. I always say take it with both hands and run with it, but um, run with it at a manageable pace with the chariot there and the knight of swords so past energies libra king of swords just about through them everywhere you get the magician eight of swords the sun I feel like in the past you have had to find other ways around things to find that happy place um, whether it's a what is your happy place who is your happy place where is your happy place the warm fuzzy feelings the happiness the joy the brilliance that that sun does bring you've been manifesting this but I feel like at times there's been roadblock after roadblock I feel like that's that deceiver energy that we're going into next but you have found other ways around things to reach that happy place legally and morally I always say but ultimately the happy place so the deceiver let's see what that's doing here Libra it is in the past the star we go into that next six of wands two of wands and that's to confirming here that there's victory here when it comes to following your dreams your wishes your goals um, you've got hopes here and it's all about um, keeping those dreams real moving towards those dreams and claiming that victory and not letting any negativity hold you back from chasing your dreams here and we've got the star here as well Libra two of cups queen of pentacles eight of wands there is love here whether it's an existing relationship whether this is somebody extremely brand new just keeping the communication open and flowing everybody on the same page making sure you get the full story this may be love that you're wishing for you're hoping for in the past here and it may still be an existing relationship as i said but you're proud of your achievements you've put a lot of hard work in to get here and now it's all starting to come to life these these dreams are starting to come to some sort of reality here love that so present energies this may be the leap of faith the next step or the first step even so the fall strength the hermit ace of cups definitely a new chapter when it comes to love and it may be a job you love it may be a home you love I feel like for some of you this is actually love love um, with um, either a pregnancy a birth marriage proposal moving in together even meeting somebody new as I said you're taking the time to do some soul searching before you take that leap of faith seeing that light at the end of the tunnel and then just going for it and getting this new chapter underway it takes a lot of strength at times to take a leap of faith um, probably more so but you don't get anywhere if you don't take the risks along the way you may have connection to Leo or Virgo here but this new journey this new chapter is beginning and it's beginning as a collaboration number one ace of cups number one queen of swords core of your reading you get the king of wands nine of pentacles the lovers and again you know what you want where you want to be possibly more so who you want somebody significant is here may have connection to a gemini soulmate twin flame here two souls that are connecting right now 
right here and that success you see that coming in it's coming your way you've got your eyes open and you can see it right in front of you love that brilliant and the two of pentacles this whole leap of faith maybe somebody popping the question somebody initially getting together two of pentacles this flew out ace of swords eight of pentacles queen of swords you just come off the queen of swords as well you had that with the star back here this whole flow on effect clearing the crap out from the past that deceiver energy is not needed it's taken a lot of hard work a lot of focus a lot of dedication to get things back into balance here and i feel like this leap of faith while it may have that ripple effect we we're talking about you still it's because of this whole direct approach towards something or someone and jumping in two feet and all but the hard work the success is on its way and it's just saying to still be aware of what's going on around you so you can manage that juggle of the two of pentacles from that ripple effect you're able to manage that a lot easier so into future energies and spirit time to collaborate or time for collaboration yep and you come to the princess of pentacles five of wands that you go into next and again the whole flow on happening the emperor ace of pentacles and definitely this new beginning is happening maybe a bit of jealousy a bit of drama a bit of conflict that you are having to deal with but there's confirmation here it's not phasing you in the slightest it's not bothering you you're in control of the situation very logical very level-headed very confident divine masculine energy you may have connection to an Aries but let's get this new chapter on the road let's bypass all the drama and get things happening in your way in your favor and it may be coming with that collaboration so five of wands here libra you get the moon the wheel of fortune queen of cups when things are a bit darker and gray around all the drama around all the conflict that moon's giving you so much more clarity to see that your wheel of fortune is on its true path to your bigger and better things to your destiny good luck good fortune hopefully for all of you you are proud of how far you've come emotionally and just confirming again you're not going to let this drama upset you in the slightest you've got bigger fish to fry is that what they say um and you're on your way to your bigger and better things love this libra you finish with the queen of wands ten of wands knight of wands four of wands maybe dealing with an air sign another libra gemini or aquarius here all about your goals your dreams your hopes stability commitment releasing this burden of feeling like you're doing this journey on your own because there is this collaboration here even if it's with the ant spirit there you're taking the ups with the downs your focus is on the end result and together you're doing this journey wow so let's finish and see what the universe says libra two of wands the universe love it the tower and again the focus on where you're heading what you want who you want where you want to be and knowing that you've got to keep moving towards those goals and those dreams working on that, achieving those results together in that collaboration allowing everything to be released out into the universe that is holding you back here because that universe is here as well from the universe you get the universe just confirming things happen for a reason things can be let go for a reason things can be mm -hmm. kept for a reason and this journey is well and truly now ready to begin this whole ace of pentacles is down here towards that stability towards that commitment and it is in that partnership wow so libra that is what i have for the week do hope it helped thanks for watching and i'll see you all next time see ya bye